It's in-depth and inspiring update to Ryan's journey. Thousands of our viewers are following a local man's weight loss efforts. Our Susan Simon, also cheering him on, joins us now with a progress report tonight, Susan. Hi, Eric. You'll recall that Ryan is the Madison man we first introduced you to last winter. We checked in on him again at the end of April, and it's been about eight weeks since we've seen him. To refresh your memory, Ryan is trying to lose 500 pounds without surgery. When we first met him in February, his goal was to lose enough weight to be able to go to the pool by the end of the summer. Well, check the calendar. It's only July 8th. And guess where we found him when we checked in last week? So, this is Ryan running. In the swimming pool at his west side home with his trainer, Annette Plant, by his side, Ryan Berta is shattering a goal he set for himself long ago. Total update. Yeah. Since September, 148 pounds and 71 and a quarter inches down. It's a long way from where Ryan started at nearly 800 pounds. Twice a week, Ryan works out for an hour in the pool. The benefit for him is that we can do things that because of impact and weight would be disastrous on his joints on land. So we'll do some resistance training in the water too, using his body weight in the shallower areas. And then we do his cardiovascular in the deeper areas. You like being in the water, buddy? Love it. There's such a sensation for me to be in the water and be able to kind of go with how I kind of feel like I am on the inside. Yeah. The person Ryan is on the inside is coming back with every pound lost. The frightened, fragile man we met in February is gone. And a happier, more confident person is taking his place. But it seems like for me to kind of get into a a dark place where you kind of get a little apathetic about it or sloppy, if you will, like that would, that hurts. It just hurts me now. Sticking with the program has had huge rewards. Ryan's diabetes is gone. And in April, he got back in his truck for the first time in two years. But it hasn't always been easy. To be honest with you, this is like over, I'd say since the springtime, it's kind of been tough a little bit, just balancing so much of this. But I mean, not... Not looking back, trying to keep looking forward and, and look at where things are at. Quieting the emotional demons that caused the weight gain in the first place is a battle Ryan faces one day at a time. But now he's had a taste of true success. I'm really stoked to just kind of get back and be who I want to be for a while in my life. Because, I mean, life is short. I know that's cliche, but there's a ton of stuff I want to do. And there's a ton of stuff that I don't even really know I want to do, but I'm sure I want to try. Ryan is at 660 pounds this week. His new goal is to be under 600 by the end of the year. Ryan updates our viewers regularly on a blog on our website, channel3000.com, and he credits a lot of his success to a site called sparkpeople.com. He puts his food journals there, and it's a place where people on weight loss journeys across the country connect. And a lot of viewers have been emailing me wanting to know details about Ryan's specific plan, things like what exactly he's eating and how much and when. So in a couple of weeks, we're going to give you a chance to ask Ryan himself. It's a little difficult right now because Annette changes his mm. plan every week to keep his body guessing. But people want to know what the secret is, right. how he's doing this. It's such an uplifting story to get updates on. It's such a good story to keep following. And they're going to hold Ryan and Annette are going to have kind of a panel discussion too, right? Right. If you or someone you know has 75 or more pounds to lose, we're going to invite you to come and meet Ryan and Annette both and ask them questions, and they can tell you exactly what they're doing. So stay tuned to Ryan's blog on our website on Channel 3000 for details. We'll let you know as soon as we have an exact date, probably you, in a couple You know weeks. I like math and crunch numbers. <laughs> I crunched them. He's already lost 18, 19 percent of his total body weight from where he started. Look at him moving in that pool. It's so a, dramatic from is. when we it first met him. It is a huge him. change. Yep. Great story, Susan. Great to come in tonight, too. <laughs> You're welcome. Past, past her bedtime, everybody. <laughs> Thanks, Susan.